In today's video, we're going to take a look at Document Attach and Dynamics GP. The first thing we need to do is make sure that Document Attach is set up to work. In Dynamics GP, go into the menu, and the first thing we'll look at is the setup. So Tools, Setup, Company, and go down to Document Attachment Setup. In here, we want to make sure that we specify where these documents will be stored. We can also choose to delete them from the file. And we want to make sure that check marks are in here if we want documents to be allowed to be deleted and if we want them to send as an attachment in an email. Once these settings are correct, we click on OK. To use the document attachment feature, we can simply go into our sales transaction area, the customer area, or the vendor area. Let's take a look at sales transaction. In a new transaction, we see the attachment icon up here with a paper clip or down here with each line item. I'm going to pull up an existing transaction. And notice with this one, I already have documents attached and the icon changes to a piece of paper behind the paper clip. I simply click on the attach button and the window comes up that allows me to add multiple documents to this transaction. If I want to add something to a line item, I click on the line item, then the paper clip icon, and again I can add in multiple documents to that line item. To do that, I click on attach. I select the document that I want to attach to that item open and now we see it appear. If I want to preview the document, I can select it, say preview, and it will pull up a preview for me. Once I'm done, I save everything and I can close my window. Same thing with the customer or the vendor cards. I can go ahead and attach document to this card the same way. I click on attach, pick out the file I want, and say open. And now I see it in here. One of the nice things about document attach is that I can email those out to people. Say that I wanted to email something with a sales transaction entry. I could simply go back into that sales transaction entry where I had items, and I can use these attachments and email them as attachments. The one thing I do need to verify is that in here I have check marks in the column that allows me to email the attachments. And second, under actions, I want to make sure that I can select these attachments to send in my email. I would put check marks in next to the items I want to be able to attach to an email, click on OK. And now I can go ahead and send out my email and select which attachments I'd like to go along. If you have more questions on Document Attach feature in Dynamics GP, please let us know. Give us a call at Crestwood. Thank you.